Take one, scene one, Ellen. I'm a disaster for this system. I change my gender, but everybody else can't. Which is just awful. Okay, transgender Tino are. 生まれた時に付けられた gender と違う gender で生活している人のことを指します。So,、um, my name is Ellen McCready. I teach linguistics and philosophy of language at i a m a g a k u r i University. I'm a professor there.、Um, I've been teaching there since 2006, and I've been in Japan for a Nihon Taizai Ju Kyu Nen de Monaika. Ju Go Nen, Ju Nan Nen Gura is Ne. You don't say s How would I describe my family? So, a concrete description of my family there's me, there's my wife, there are three kids,、um, ages 10, 16, and 17. The kids are all healthy, we are healthy, the family is very normal. The end. <laughs> Are you ready? Hi. Eh, what are some of the things that you have to do? Kazoku. Kazoku. No, 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 と長男が今アメリカの方に留学していて僕が次男でそれで、えっと、弟がいるんですけど弟はあの日本の方の学校に通ってます。マクレディ・タイラーで10歳です。であと何か趣味とかありますか趣味はない。趣味はないか。<笑> I'm done. <laughs> How did you explain your transition and your relationship to your children? So, you have to ask、uh, for the oldest child, you have to ask me Dory because she just told him without telling me she was going to tell him. No, no, no. no. <laughs> one one day just... I, came, I, I, I walked into the kitchen, you were like,、mm-hmm. by the way, I told Kai you were transitioning, and I'm like,、mm-hmm. You did what? Don't you remember this? That's convenient, but you did. <laughs> but then, it, like, when, when I, so he's in Texas now going to high school and staying with my mom. But when I took him to Austin, we did talk about it, and he was just like, okay. I don't really have anything to talk about that, he said. With my middle one, I just went up to his room and, t- and sat him down and said, so, do you know what? It means to be transgender. He said, Yeah. I said, Well, I am. He's like, Oh, that's cool. I'm cool with that. No problem. And then he wrote me a very sweet letter later.、Mm-hmm. And with the youngest one, it seemed, who was nine at the time, it's, it was very hard to decide what to tell him to make it simple, but yet not wrong. Because you don't want to say, Okay, so I was this and now I'm that, which doesn't seem quite right. So, just because people think somebody is a man doesn't mean they're really a man. Just because people, th- people think somebody's a woman doesn't mean they're necessarily a woman like me. And he's like, and he, it was funny because he,、uh, he already knew everything, obviously, because it was, you know, obvious. <laughs> and he, so he's like, No! Can we do that? No, he said it to you, right?、Like、no, he, no, no. No, he didn't he, say it to he, me. No, no. No. Did no. he? Yeah. 
Yeah. Oh, yeah, that's right. He's, we were speaking Japanese, actually. I'm like, yeah, yeah, koyukuto, koyukuto. And he's like, eh? Uso daro? And I'm like, yeah, uso <laughs> janai kedo. And he's like, sonna koto dekin no? Kati ni. Kati ni sonna koto shite ii no? Te he said. Ii janai? Mitoma. And uh, he, I think she said, uh, you know, people, uh, all people is free. So, yeah, people can do whatever you want. Mm-hmm. Yeah. I don't know if you have any questions, but what do you think about the time? What do you think about the time? What do you think about the time? I don't know. I like it. 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 自分として母は二人いると思ってるんですか、うん、思ってないどう思ってる普通にどういう意味それ、うん、お父さんだけど女、はい、ありがとうございますお疲れお疲れ,お疲れ様です<笑>母は二人いるっていうことだと思ってるんですか。うん、それでも僕はそのなんていうのかな父親的に頼ってしまうっていうのはあるかもしれないですね。じゃあそうではない,っていうかもしれない。Can I say something? Yeah. yeah. So I think that even the word c h i c h i and h a h a and o t o s a n o k a s a n mother, father. It's really complicated. It, it's, not, it's not even clear what it means. Is it a social, a social position? A, is it a family? A, a, like something you, the way work is divided inside the family? And this kind of. So when you say, like, Chichi oya toshite tayoru, that's like very independent of actual, of like gender. Shoujiki, ima mo transgender te. なんかこうクエスチョンマークがもうわって感じで全然わかんないんですあの特に日本にいるとトランスだけじゃなくてゲイにしてもレズビアンにしても全ての、まあ、LGBT の方の全てにおいてもあの日本人って無知すぎると思いますだからいつも日々彼女からあの説明されて LGB are all defined by sexuality Um, it's, it's about who you're se- interested in sexually, who your partners are, who you fall in love with.、Um, whereas trans people are defined by their own gender. It's not relational in the same way. You could be gay and trans, you could be straight and trans, you could be bi and trans. Of course, there are trans lesbians and trans gay men. So the categories are completely cross cutting, actually. So, <laughs> that's it. 私がいつもあの生きる基準にしてるのは全ての人があの幸福感を持ってあの人生を終えるっていうのがそれがあの一つの一番あの全て教育においてもあの子供を育てることに対してもお友達でいることに対してもあの彼女といることに対しても全ての人が幸福である。っていう意味でトランスジェンダーの方がこうだと言ってこうしたいって言ってるんだったらそうしてそうさせてあげたいただそれだけです。OK。So you're a white trans woman in Japan.、Um, how is this experience different in Japan versus in America? Okay, so I've never really been a white trans woman in America. But from these limited samples, I can say it's so much easier to pass there. And like, there's so much less. Well, I mean, you could, just come, you could just ask the question, the prior question What's the difference between being a white person in the US and in Japan? But okay, so what privileges do I have here? Well, okay, so starting with the easy one. I have a good job. I'm a university professor. If I say that to people, they back down a lot of the time. That's privilege. Okay, I'm white in this country.、Um, that leads to a lot of people giving me things that I wouldn't otherwise get. 
Is that always a nice thing? No, definitely not. But it's definitely a privilege. Okay. Why do you say it's not always a nice thing? What do you mean by that? So, um... Was it two years ago? I guess two years ago, yeah. I got an award for writing the best academic work in the university that year. Then, <clears throat> a few months later, the university president invited me to become head of this research institute on AI and the technological singularity. And I'm like, why? Why me? Because I'm a linguist, basically, right? He says, oh, because you do AI. And I'm like, well, not really. He said, well, it said in your bio that you do AI. I'm like, yeah, I do things that are relevant to AI, but it's not really AI. But he said, okay, but we want you to do it because you're the best person. I said, okay, I'll do it. So I'm the head of this research institute, but somebody from the board of regents came to my office and told me, he said, he said, so some people don't like straight talk, and but I'm an honest person, and I just have to say, and I'm like, oh God. <laughs> and he said, you know why you got this job? Because Blondie. And I'm like, oh. He said, I'm like, go on. He says, yeah, because it's good for us if we have a white face on the flyer. It's better to, like, if you have to choose between getting undeserved or undesired privileges or undeserved and undesired discrimination, of course you choose the privilege. That's If that's the choice. But you don't want it. あ、とね、これも答えなくてもいいと思いますけど、あの、難しかった。そう、あの、人種差別ってそれやなんか性差別ってどんな差別でもいいんだけど、そういうこと経験したことありますか。うん。その差別的ではあるんですけど、それでも
So she asked the owner, and the owner said, apparently, if her ID says F, she can get in. The bouncer said, Ichio F de Kaideru. So Ichio F de Kaideru would be something like, well, I guess it says F, but. I was like, don't you think that's rude? And he just gave me this stare, and then he said, please wait here. And I'm like, oh, okay. Then somebody came out and he said, sorry, are you trans? I said, yes. They said, oh, well, our policy is no trans women, so sorry, you cannot come in. And I said, oh, really? And then my friends were like, you know, she's on the guest list. What's up? What's up? And my, my friend came out who was DJing and like, there was a big thing. And then the owner came out and said, sorry, please understand. It's our policy. And then there was more shouting and more argument. And I was standing there just like, cringing on display, which was awful. And finally I said, but then why did you say I could get in? And she said, I never said that. I said, okay. And then my friend said, okay, I'm not gonna play. So she went and got her record bag and walked out. And, the, and then the owner flipped out and started screaming about how she had no respect and she didn't care about people. As I stand there, I'm like, wow, that's a thing. So then we just left. And that was that. That's so that's what happened. Super long oh, so, so it's not just being sterilized, right? So if you want to change your legal gender in Japan, you have to be sterilized. You cannot be married. You cannot have minor children. And of course you have to have a diagnosis of dysphoria and some treatment. Gender dysphoria. There's no basis for that. And the requirement that people be sterilized is just, it's invasive, it's disgusting, and it's completely unwarranted. Um, and you've basically broken all of those because you have a family, yeah. you have minor children. I'm a disaster for this system. I, we broke the system. Okay, so I changed my gender marker in the States, changed my passport, changed my residence card. Then I went to change the Jumin Hyo, but the, the, the residence card issued by the local government which has family information on it. That's the first one that has family stuff written there. And so I went there to ch I went there and say, okay, here's my new residence card. Please update this information to reflect my new name and gender. And they look at the old one and they say, oh, but this person, it says Midori, wife. So you guys are divorced? And I'm like, no. And they said, so should we just remove her? And I'm like, no. <laughs> and they're like, um, let me go talk to my boss. So they went and talked to the boss, came back and said, well, you know, we don't have same-sex marriage, so we can't really do this. We can't make this decision here, so we're going to send it to the Tokyo local government, and they'll make a decision. But they, they, they wouldn't take that responsibility either, and they sent it on to the Ministry of Justice. So a reporter from BuzzFeed, Sumiriko Tomita, talked to them a few weeks ago, and they said, okay, we don't know what to, we don't know what to do, and we don't... We have never thought about this kind of case, we are literally at a loss and we have no prospect of a decision at this moment. Like, just, just around the same, just after the six month mark, the local government called us, and, or actually called me at the airport. I was just in the airport. My ramen had just come. And I had the phone rings and it's the local government. And they say, oh, well, we decided that since the, the national government is making, not giving us any decision, but we, we cannot just leave your paperwork like this. So we're gonna just write you down as distant relatives. Is that okay? And I'm like, what, 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 what? Nobody told me anything about that. Don't do that. We told you not to do that. Tabun, <laughs> 何、もう、
あのパートナーとして尊敬しててあのそれで子供たちの親として尊敬しててでもあのそしてこの仕事の面でもす全て尊敬できる人でこ,うこれほど尊敬できる人はいないっていうかあの性格もいいしなんかえっとこれ以上の人は多分もうパ,パートナーとしては見つけられないと思っててどうするかっていうので今はこうちょっとポリアモリー的な感じで私は他にパートナー男性ストレートの男性のパートナーがいパートナーっていうか彼氏がいてで彼女もなんかいい人ができればいいなと思ってるんですけどでもあの家族としてだからといってその。これ以上いあ、ね、あの大好きなお姉さんと一緒に住んでるのになんでそれでそれが一番コンフォータブルなのにそれをなんか崩さないといけないっていう理由はどこにもないと思うんですよね。はい、We are a married couple. So, yeah, so don't, don't take away our married status. Don't, why would you do that? So we told them that, I told them that already, and they're doing it. They're like, we're just going to do that because we have the right to do that, and we feel we need to, to legitimate our paperwork. So that was a thing. And then、um, actually, then Sumiriko, I told, I told her about this, and she called them. And the next morning, they called up and said, No, never mind. We don't do that. <laughs> yeah. They said, Okay, we want you guys to file a position, a brief, a position paper, what you want us to do, and we will file one too. And we'll send them both to the national government and they can decide. So, actually, the, it's, it could turn out to be a good thing because it could be that since the local government starts pushing, the national government has to make a decision. And they, they know, I guess, that if the local government does this, it's the worst possible outcome because it doesn't even make any sense. Right? It's like, you, we're not just doing railroads. We're either a married couple or we are nothing, right? So at the moment, we are a same sex marriage. So are we legal? I guess so. At the moment, we're, you know, it's, it's, completely, it's completely strange. And now, we're like, the ministry of, somebody at the Ministry of Justice apparently told a reporter that they never anticipated this possibility and we are. Unprecedented in the system, and we are a total problem. They don't know what to do at all. But for me, it's weird because, like, this is an example of this privilege thing in a way. So, I'm a person living in Japan who, in this, in this area of legal, legality, doesn't have to abide by the Japanese rule. And so, this is massive privilege. I changed my gender, but everybody else can't, which is just awful. そうえっと、日本人の基本にしてることってこうして恥ずかしいか恥ずかしくないかだと思うんですよね。例えば子供にしの電車の中でお母さんが怒って「座りなさい恥ずかしいでしょ!」っていうそうじゃないっていうことがなんかそのだからみんなブランドバッグを持ってたらあれはきっといいものに違いないみたいな自分で判断することが全くできてない人がすごく多いと思うんですよね。だからそのえっと、自分の価値観でルールだから赤信号だから信号止まるんじゃなくてなんで止まらなければいけないかっていうのをみんな一人一人がもう少し考えられるような教育にしなければいけないと思ってます。What is it about Japanese society that's making people have problems? Okay, but a very, a, very short, a very short kind of answer, the one that occurs to me at this, at this moment, the short answer that occurs to me right now is people here are really willing to not do things on the surface. And so <clears throat> discrimination happens below the surface. People won't say, no, you cannot. They'll say, hmm. And then the people who, who hear, hmm, they think, oh, that means I cannot, so I will not try. And so everybody just、hmm, together. And that's the end of the story every time. It's not just in these LGBT stuff, it's also in racism, it's in, in, in bad government policies, in bad, bad policies within companies, and everywhere. Everybody's just willing to sit down and shut up in the face of silence. Changing that would change a lot.
So my, my read of the situation is that there's, there's three possibilities for the national government. The distant relatives pot one is not really a possibility, right? So it doesn't make sense. So possibility one, just say, okay, president, same-sex marriage. Possibility two is to say, no, we're going to annul your marriage. But I don't know that they actually have the right to do that. And if they do, that's a court case. And that might be a winnable court case. Because the, the court cases that we've seen so far are cases like, allow us to get married. But we are married. So that's a different case. Does the, does the government have the right to annul a marriage for, reason, for some reason? Because of the change in someone's status? Don't know. But I think there's a battle to be fought there, which I think we, can, we might be able to win. But if I was a bureaucrat sitting in a windowless office, not wanting to take responsibility for setting national agendas, then I would do ni neither of those things. And I would say, yeah, same-sex marriage is fine in the case where one partner is non-Japanese and that partner changes their gender in their, in their home country and that trickles down to Japan because there aren't that many of us. That's, that's the smallest solution for the bureaucracy. But we'll see. Okay, so your fight as a transgender woman not only affects transgender women in Japan, but it also affects the entire LGBT community. And you keep going also despite having being discriminated by um, lesbians or other people from the LGBT community. What makes you go on and fighting for the entire community despite getting like being discriminated by them too, or like, you know, facing bigoted people. Well, I mean, we can fight, right? I have a good job. I have, I have a <clears throat> permanent residency here. I'm not going to get thrown out, I guess. <laughs> so, you know, some people are discriminatory. Some people are bigoted, but many people are not. And even if they are, even if people are, why? shouldn't we try to make things better for them? Especially when it will also make things better for us. I think that's it. Yeah, thank you so much. Alright, cut! That was, that was an answer question.